we had a long discussion with our brethren United Naga Council's delegation in Imphal. Around about six hours sittings were held today. It was regarding the very unfortunate incident that had happened on 15th of July. During the discussion, uh, Kokomi had expressed its uh, dissatisfaction or anguish over the incident that had happened. And we clarified that that incident was not a mandated incident. And as per the United Naga Council's uh, demand that the culprit should be uh, punished as per the law of the land, we also accept, uh, accepted what the United Naga Council is uh, appealed. And above that, uh, we agreed we have agreed to address this issue jointly together and pursue the state government so that necessary steps can be taken up by the government to compensate the unfortunate incident. And Kokomi also took the uh, moral responsibilities of the very unfortunate incident and we condemned it at the strongest terms. And for the few future course of uh, action to not let such kind of incident happen again. We have also mutually agreed to work together so that such kind of incident don't happen again. And today's uh, very wishful and very mature efforts uh, or initiatives or response coming in from the United Naga Council side is overwhelming and we are very thankful and appreciate the goodwill gestures from the veterans of the Nagas and we will work together and look forward to maintain the age old blood, blood bond relationship between our Naga brothers and we also appeal to the general public both in among the Metes and the Nagas that any incident if happened without the conscience of the United Naga Council and the Kokomi then we have to handle it together so that any sort of misunderstanding should not happen again in future. Therefore, we also appeal to all the general public that please be little conscious, little, 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 you know, uh, sensitive in handling the situation. Mob cannot uh, justify anything. If we have any doubt, maybe among the Nagas or among the Maitais, please first contact to responsible organizations and leaders so that we can sort out before anything unwanted happens. Therefore, we appeal all the public in Manipur that what had happening, you know, what had been what has been happening for the past 70 years, 70 days is not, not not something that we wanted. However, it's going on. Therefore, we appeal that we should restrain as much as possible so that such kind of incident don't happen again in future. Any kind of uh, misunderstanding, stray uh, incidents, and this kind of things from day one of the uh, this uh, problem. Till now, we are maintaining this way, and we will continue to maintain it, and we will continue to. Bring, we are going to, to bring normalcy to the state. Since this is our uh, concern, so we appealed all the communities living in the state of Manipur to some government to build better understanding and to come forward to bring norms. So it's a way forward and it's a turning point for the Vitae community and the Naga as well. The day we heard of this incident was a very sad day and very shocking to all of us. But as today we have come to the conclusion, we have resolved the issue. It has yeah, 
it's been a turning point with Marcus. So I also thank the Kumi for the initiative. So because of them, these solutions has come. With the initiative of Kumi, you will see if Kumi is here together and we have resolved that the culprits should be booked, should be arrested and give defeating punishment. The ritual ceremony of uh, Lady Lucy shall be for perhaps according to the custom for which it will be arranged. All the uh, logistic arrangement will be done from us, from the government. And we will keep on check. All the uh, to ensure the free uh, free movement, free passage of all the commuters around the state, and that responsible should be equally uh, taken by Kukumi and Sulaiman. UNC has been maintaining. With utmost reserve job for the surviving dog. And also, they have uh, given the uh, education security. 